Hello, this is Charles Wright at Master Color Labs. In this video, I just want to demonstrate how easy it is to order holiday cards uh, using our Rose software. Uh, nice thing about our software is you can also um, use it to create birthday cards or anything else you need during the year. Um, so let's get started just by going to our, our, our ordering page. Uh, again, familiar site, an area where all your images can be loaded by clicking on your Add Image folder. Again, I like using images that I've put in folders on my desktop just for the uploading speed and the convenience of scrolling through. Uh, this is our working space, and on the left-hand side are our different items that we offer. Um, and it always defaults to our standard size, and since that's what most people are ordering, are just straight photographs, but uh, greeting cards is just to the right here. Uh, we have several different types. These are our 4x8 slimline cards. You probably remember these. They were more popular in the 90s before digital and the printing press cards took off, but simply a drag and drop is all you need. Click on the text box to add your family's name and just hit add to cart. Uh, but more popular these days are our uh, folded greeting cards. Also, some people now are doing the flat digital press cards, uh, but let's just do a 5 by 7 since it's probably the most complex, and then we can uh, kind of go from there to see you know, if, if you have any questions or problems. But uh, let's just say you choose this 5 by 7 uh, vertical card. Well, there's a blank space that's showing up here, so most people don't even typically have anything on the back. Maybe the company that made the, the card or now is popular to add in other photos from a vacation or whatever you want to show. Uh, but let's just say uh, we're going to add this picture here. It comes in as a horizontal, so again, we do need to change that. So we just click on it, do one click, and it makes it into a vertical for you, nice and neat. But let's say you also want to have that special picture on the back. You just go up here to draw a new node where the images are going to be located. Kind of draw yourself a square there. Um, let's say we're going to use a uh, family photo for the back. Let's say we want a little more detail, so we're going to go up. After you've dragged your image in, you need to go to the hand tool. That makes you allowed to um, manipulate the image within that node. And I'm just enlarging the picture and centering it up nicely. Um, and perfect ready to go. Let's say we wanted to give a farewell greeting on the back. We just grab the same draw tool that includes the text um, and we'll create a little text for ourselves. After you've drawn the box you then go down to the text tool, click into the, oops I'm sorry, you get in your hand, oops, click in here and put uh, happy 2013. And the Rose software is a little confusing and it doesn't work like a program where you can just highlight and change the font size. Um, it's going to try to fill your font space from left to right and if you want it smaller you simply just must add spaces with your spacebar. Um, to change the font style uh, or color, first uh, click on this text tool here, choose what you want and it's, we've now turned it to Christmas red. Um, and then you can also, there are different fonts you can choose from um, over here. So well, I haven't even looked through them all, but I'm sure you can find one you like. Although I'm having a hard time at the moment. Bakersfield, there's my favorite. So once you have it the way you like, you just put in your quantity and click Add to Order. On the same thing on the inside, you would just choose an inside. And you could, we have a number of generic greetings down here that you could choose from. Or, again, simply if you want to type your own, uh, you can draw a large text box here. Oops, I drew two. So to get rid of that one. And hit, there we go. Oops. On a Macintosh, you can do this. Oops. And then hit remove and I'll take the note away. Um, but if you have any questions adding type or adding pictures, um, it can be a little tricky your first time. The nice thing about the Rose software is you can continue to play with it until you hit order and actually go through the checkout page. Nothing will be sent to the lab and nothing will be printed. So uh, it's a fun software to try to design. And, uh, but if you have any questions, give us a call, 1-800-252-1042, and we'd love to help you work through them. Have a great day.